What's going on, everybody? Joe Burrow filling in for Griffin Della Pena this week in the Halloween edition of Around Canisius Athletics presented by Niagara Scenic Tours. The women's soccer team's magical season will continue after defeating the Ryder Bronx in penalty kicks on Sunday afternoon. They will now go on the road and face the top-seeded Quinnipiac Bobcats this upcoming Thursday for a chance to advance to the championship. Head coach Ryan Louie was also just announced as the coach of the year, with Emma Oliphant receiving second-team All-Mac honors, and Jess Jones, Tiani Finotti, Megan Heath, and Lizzie Harkness finishing on the third team. Tom Eppenheimer posted a 10th place finish at the MAC Championships this past weekend, with the men's team earning a 5th place finish and the women finishing 6th. They will now have two weeks off before the NCAA Northwest Regional in the Bronx. The hockey team dropped their two games this last weekend to start out conference play to Sacred Heart 6-3 and 3-1. Freshman Hunter Andrews scored his first collegiate goal on Saturday with David Melaragni, Ryan Miato, and Nick Bowman scoring the goals on Friday night. They will come back here to Buffalo to host Holy Cross for their first home action in conference play on Friday and Saturday. The volleyball team split their two matches this week with a win against Manhattan on Saturday and a loss in straight sets to Iona on Sunday. With less than two weeks remaining until the conference tournament in Florida, they will have their final road trip on the season against Ryder on Saturday and St. Peter's on Sunday. The men's soccer team has just one game remaining on their schedule this upcoming Wednesday at Ryder, following their 2-0 loss this weekend at Quinnipiac. The rowing team finished up their fall season at the head of the Schuylkill race in Philly, highlighted with a fifth place finish for the Novice 8 boat. And on the swim and dive side, both the men's and women's team lost to Geneseo this past weekend, now with over three weeks to prepare for Cleveland State. We are now less than a week away from the men's and women's basketball home opener doubleheader against UB and Youngstown State, so make sure to purchase your tickets now. Signing off for this episode of Around Canisius Athletics, I'm Joe Scheiste. We'll see you next time. As always, go Griffs.